Yo, what is up guys? It's Zard here and today we're doing another commentary style video and there's quite a few things going on in the news and shit and most of it is pretty shitty or downright disgusting and first first off we'll talk about something a little bit lighter before we get into the the shitty stuff that's going on first we're going to talk about the island boys and they are let's just say they're sucking each other's dicks. it's I don't, I don't know how else to put it they're sucking each other off like they're just straight up sucking each other's wieners which is just completely wild and they tweeted out talking about how they are going to release a tape if you know what I, if you know what I mean. They're going to bang each other on camera, which is just absolutely fucking wild. Like, what the fuck? They're relate, aren't they twins? Hold on, let me find out if they're twins real quick. Yes, they are twins. They are fucking twin brothers going down on each other. That is just, that is so disgusting. And first of all, I just want to know, what I want to know is how the hell they're getting away with posting this. Isn't incest illegal? Hold on, hold on. I swear incest is illegal. Especially with your fucking brother. Yes, incest is a crime even if it's consensual. So why the fuck are they doing it? That is just so fucking weird. Like, not even that it's gay, it's the fact that it's just weird. Like, it's your fucking twin brother that you're going down on. Like, I cannot believe that. I thought, I thought, okay, this is kind of weird when I saw them making out with each other and shit and kissing up on each other's necks. I was like, but maybe they're just like extremely desperate for the clout they're at an all time low. They really need this clout. And they, they stood, they made out with each other for some fucking views, but no, they have a fucking only fans and selling videos of them banging each other and going down on each other. What the fuck is that? I don't know how they haven't gotten in trouble with law enforcement for this. Cause it's straight up illegal and they're fucking posting their crime. It's literally self-incriminating themselves. I wonder if they were always gay or if they're just really want that OnlyFans money that bad. Let me know in the comments if you think the Island Boys are really actually just straight homosexuals or they're just extremely desperate for that OnlyFans money. Well, I guess I don't know how they would like... They, they clearly have to be getting turned on by each other to fucking make those types of videos. I mean, I thought I didn't think very highly of the Island Boys before this, but now I'm just like wow dude what the fuck i i mean i always thought the island boys were like cocky douchebags like the way they walked off impulsive that one time after george told them that they could sell their jewelry if they ever they won't ever have to worry about being broke again or whatever but i would i never had much respect for them but this is just a whole new low like i don't think i've ever seen like an influencer drop to this level besides like the only fans girls and shit that like sell their titty pics on only fans but like that's different i've never seen to the level where i'm like fucking you know what? i'm gonna fuck my sibling for some clout i mean besides that one fucking prankster that like completely fell off and then made out with his sister in a youtube video but i mean at least he didn't fuck her you know that's the thing at least he didn't bang his sister okay now it's time for some of the not so fun stuff to cover um yeah so i found this shit while i was doom scrolling instagram reels last night i don't think i'm surprised that it's not being talked about as much as it is like i feel like this should be much more of a topic than it is right now basically i was doom scrolling instagram and i saw this post this dude made talking about how fucking people now on instagram are using ai to make ai children and create fake cp you know cheese pizza cod points cp i'm not gonna say it child p you know what i mean and that is just like in my opinion well my opinion this should be this is objective at this point that is just fucking straight down disgusting these instagram pages what they're basically doing obviously i'm not gonna show any pictures I don't know why, but today just all the controversies that are going on are just all like shit that's either so disgusting I can't show it or there's no pictures of it. So I apologize for that. Well, I don't apologize for this fucking part for not showing this fucking part. Obviously, I'm not sorry. If you want me to show this part, you're a fucking freak. Basically, they're using AI to create children, fake children, and post them in inappropriate scenarios, outfits, shit like that. Posting them like they're these fucking 
OnlyFans whores, and they link a Patreon in their Instagram bio, and they're selling on their Patreon AI cheese pizza, if you know what I mean. It's fucking downright disgusting, and the craziest part is most of these pages have not been banned by Instagram yet. Like, how is that possible? Instagram needs to hop the fuck on this. I don't know how the fuck they have not been banned off Instagram yet, and I don't care what you say. I guess that we're back to the fucking lolly argument that's been had on the internet a million times because in the fucking bios of these fucking ai cheese pizza accounts it's like all the girls depicted in these pictures are characters over 18 no they are fucking children what the fuck is wrong with these people it like it's not okay i don't care about the whole lolly shit where it's like a fucking hentai of a little girl and they're like oh but she's actually three thousand years old what the fuck no it's still a fucking child who the f- like, what the fuck is wrong with you? If you're actually watching this type of shit, go get some fucking help. It's fucking disgusting. And the worst part is how many followers these accounts has. What the actual fuck? How- there's- I cannot fathom that there's people out there that are actually into this. And I'm not just talking like teenagers that these people are making cheese pizza of. These are like little fucking girls. Like little children. Like, like, they look like eight, nine, you know? This is actually horrible. I think I need to just stop talking about this before I actually lose my fucking shit. Cause this is like, I, like the, the fact that this exists makes me fucking mad. And I, I just, the internet pisses me off sometimes. Even though I want it to be my job, the fucking terrible shit that goes on in here pisses me the fuck off sometimes. But I better go to the next story before I lose my fucking mind over this. Her fucking little Tay from back in like 2017. She was the little Asian chick that would fucking, like, nine years old, she would flex her mom's money and shit, and her little brother would, or her older brother would report it and tell her what to say, and she'd be like, oh, I got all this money, and, like, flex her mom's car and at their fucking rental properties and shit like that. It's, you know, it was funny at the time, but apparently news has come out, hold on, let me pull it up, that she is dead. She has died. Um, I'm putting the picture the screenshot from her instagram on screen right here it says it is with a heavy heart that we shared the devastating news that our beloved claire i guess her real name is claire sudden and tragic passing we have no words to express the unbearable loss and indescribable pain this outcome was entirely unexpected and has left us all in shock her brother's passing adds an even more imaginal death to our grief though so i guess her brother has died too during this time of immense sorrow we Kindly ask for privacy. We grieve this overwhelming while we grieve this overwhelming loss. Sorry, fucking retarded. As the circumstances surrounding Claire and her brother's passing are still under investigation, Claire will forever remain in our hearts, her absence leaving an irreplaceable void that will be felt by all who knew and loved her. Pretty sad if this is real. That's the part that a lot of people are talking about is is this real? Because it was so random and so out of nowhere and she just was going through a lawsuit recently after i don't know what it was hold on let me i'm gonna do some research real quick so it looks like here lil tay was involved in a lawsuit with her own father from what i'm seeing which raises some eyebrows the day before she died she won the lawsuit against her father which definitely raises some eyebrows so a lot of people are thinking either she would faked her death to get away from the internet which is understandable people have done it before where they faked their death just to get away from the internet and i completely understand it she was fucking forced to be on the internet since she was nine and being a like b-list celebrity and it's also quite suspicious that her brother died at the same time i'm hearing a lot of different things right now it's all speculation at the moment people are saying that she killed herself people are saying she was in a car accident there's even some suspicion that her parents killed them there's suspicion that her dad or her mom killed her and her brother which like i said it's all speculation this is all alleged i mean nobody's actually accusing anyone officially yet but people are saying that they're suspicious that her parents killed her which would be absolutely fucking wild in my opinion what my best guess is that she faked her death i'm not saying but what she if she did actually die this is actually this is extremely sad fucked up i'm not going to be putting her in the thumbnail or anything I don't want to farm clout off of a little girl dying if she did die. So I'm not going to put her in the thumbnail or nothing. Don't worry about that. 
But yeah, extremely sad if she actually did die, but there is a lot of suspicion here. I'll look for some tweets saying. The word around is that it was suicide. Someone says makes sense. I mean, I that does make sense. I like it does make sense for her so she was only 14 today. It does make sense that she would kill herself considering the immense pressure from the internet, but what doesn't add up to me is her brother dying at the same time. That's what raises my eyebrow. And oh, and it says here that Apparently, her father was abusive, which points more towards the murder part. So I'm hearing Lil Tay's death is a murder-suicide. The, the, the rumors here are just all over the fucking place. There's people saying it was a murder-suicide, people saying she killed herself. It's just, I there's it's so all over the place. There just needs to be time for this all to clear out. I have no clue, but I think that definitely an investigation of her parents should take place if the death truly is unknown and people aren't just hiding the death because they don't want to talk about how their family member died and all that which is completely understandable too but for the reason of her death is truly unknown there definitely needs to be an investigation and needs to go down because her dad was abusive from what it says or it could have been her fucking brother who knows her brother could have been the murderer and the person who committed suicide who fucking knows maybe her brother did it but there is just speculation all over the fucking place about this there's no clear answer of what happened and when there is a clear answer i will make a video and if there is a clear answer by the time of the day after tomorrow when i make another one of these videos i will let you guys know but yeah that's basically all that's going on guys just I, I would say if you enjoyed this video leave a like but i don't think this is one of the videos where you're going to be enjoying it too much it was more informative we talk about little girls killing herself ai cheese pizza and the island boys sucking each other off so not a super fun video but leave a like support me subscribe do all that use code azar96 at w.gg all that leave a comment boost me in the algorithm go follow my other social medias linked in the description but that's all i got to tell you guys for today i'll upload a roblox video tomorrow i'll see you guys in the next one